And welcome back ladies and gentlemen, this is James and we're continuing our playthrough of Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, in the last episode, we um, did a mission with Franklin, basically Trevor, because Trevor had the O'Neill brothers ready to come and and kill him. Um, but we took care of them. Um, and this episode we are going to go do the heist that we just the setup for with the military hardware. Um, and I kept talking about how we need to do a quick save before we actually started doing this while well, I've done or have already done my quick save and when we get to the um, when we get to the part where we need to worry about the quick save I'll explain it but let's sit here and listen to what's being said here it's 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 not inappropriate it's it's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. First you take a hostage against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her. Are you nuts? She's she's a 60-year-old housewife. Wow, she's 57. And she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them. And now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey. You mother... Hey! What? You know, you got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Here's the shot. We're going to Palano Bay. We're going to do this thing. Any questions? Comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. <coughs> that crazy motherfucker was with us now. He would have loved this. Instead, he's got to enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody else? What about me? You'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in, you grab the tape, they rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Is that a uh, work for everyone? Great. Let's go. Okay, now that was a very interesting conversation held by those guys. Polito Bay, let's hit this shit. Now we're off to Polito Bay and we're going to hear stories of people's first bank jobs. So, and if we're making the trip, let's sit back and enjoy the Never hit a bank stories. before, Franklin. Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar pulled. Guess it's the same kind of shit we're doing now, right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Come on. Everyone remembers their first score. Uh, shit, not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah, 25 years ago. Jesus! You, generic goon. What was your first bank score? I was somewhat of a prodigy. Dropped out of school, wanted to start taking down joints. Didn't know how to do it. And then it clicked. I got the most powerful weapon on the planet, up here. My mind, right? Uh, yeah. Soon as I understood that, I wrote a note, handed it to a teller, walked out of the bank with a couple of grand, did it again the next day. Got caught on the fifth job and got sent away for ten years. That's, uh, too bad. So, uh... No, 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 no. Best thing that could have happened to me. I really studied inside. Psychology, sociology, animal behavior. Now my brain's a super weapon. <laughs> you know, I got some ideas about how this job might be run more efficiently. Yeah, yeah. Good for you. Hey, your turn to share, kid. 
I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death, bonding, pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here, soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember... If he don't remember... Remember, I'm supposed to trust this man with my life, and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job. Well, how about you? Why don't you share with the group? I'm here. I'll back the facts. The check's cash place. I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Yeah. It was a bit more complicated than that, though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did six months. Maybe. I was out in four, and that, children, is why we don't leave witnesses. That, children, is why you don't rob people that you know! <laughs> yeah. Watch the what fuck the out, hell? will ya? Franklin, Cher... Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. Alright, man, shit. Okay, the score was like two stacks, man. 2G? Take home on your first gig? Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Die pack went off, home. Money was useless then. Die pack? <laughs> you amateur! I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, Franklin, we all gotta start somewhere. Last time I tell your ass something. Ow, oh, come on. <laughs> Don't be so cool, man. Learn to laugh at yourself. You're in danger of turning into this man. Who, me? Yeah, you. Wouldn't laugh, wouldn't hang out. Uh, I've got my work, I've got my life, and never the two shall meet. If we're risking our asses, we gotta be family. How about that, die pack? Man, fuck you, sense of humor. Hey, let's just do this thing, all right? All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, get ready, because we're gonna wanna go ASAP. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. Okay, so we heard this thing conversation about people's first scores. This is drop Franklin off here. He's the getaway. All right, you know where you gotta be. I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you. We ready for this? I could use a restroom break. And risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. I gotta go! Number two! Well, you're gonna have to hold that number two. You all ready? Let's go! <clears throat> all right. So let's go and do this thing, and once we get to um, let's go. the part where the reason why we need to quick save, I'll explain to y'all exactly yeah. what's going oh. on. We're robbing you! Today's going one of two ways, friends! Everyone on the floor! Now! You and you! Out from behind the counter! That's it! Hands in the air! You getting off on this, little man? Em! Keep an eye on our trusted employee! Okay! You got the crowd! Cops should be here soon, so keep an eye out! I'll cut through the door, Em! Just need you to kick it open! Down! Down! <laughs> If I ever meet this alarm guy, I'll fucking shoot him. Yeah, not if I get to him first. Yeah. Stay back! We got hostages! Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. <laughs> Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways of beating it. Man, that money just climbed down there. That eight million. $16,000. I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the hostages go, and uh, we'll talk like gentlemen. Time to face the music. Ah! Okay, now Trevor has what they call a minigun. Sweet mother. We are shit. not using Trevor's minigun. We're going to swap over to Michael. Suicidal asshole! And he's just bad boy. Oh, shit! 
See what I did? This ain't about you, you self-mythologizing cur! Now we are losing some money, and we will continue to lose the money, but... Take it out! But losing the money really ain't that big of a deal. You hear that, guys? Shit! We are getting out on the water! This is a shit show! More cops! Let's go then! We're not going through this, not with 50 pounds of gear! Blast it! Let's go! By the pool! We're bringing down the fences here, real and emotional. I've been carrying you guys <clears throat> through this! I should've organized the job! Professionals? You're dope! You have caused enough damage! Give it up! Hey, Frank! We need another escape room. Can you find a vehicle? Something might stand up to gunfire. There's some construction around the way. All right. Keep behind the car. We go right through them, gentlemen. They got a noose unit in Shitsville? What? No, just perfect. This is it. Let's go. Perfect. The bomb squad. Up car incoming. Lay down your weapon. Let us fight into them! Are you seeing that? Oh, look, look at this! They were in there playing transfer! It's too heavy! You wanna play dead? We won't be playing! Hey, hey! Through here! Okay, now right here is why we needed to do a, a quick save. Because our little friend up here, he just got brain his dude, and he's on dead. Generic goons gonna be on um, his own with a big but we... <laughs> there was a bag down there that had all of our money in it. If we had to pick that up, we would have been pretty much broke. Now we're gonna take out, take so, take out all uh, these before we can advance. War Army? This is why our defense spending is as much as the rest of the world can find. Just back the fuck off a minute! So far, we've only lost a little over two ball. grand, which ain't <coughs> too bad. Ah, uh, T? What the hell is that? That's the tank hanging from a chopper. And now we're really going to start losing some money. But we got to get Franklin over there as fast as we can. I'm on my way. You can see the money is starting to, to drop. You okay? I ain't dead yet. I'm on my way. How many dudes they got in this private army? Hey man, these guys are every fucking win. Hey asshole, out of the way. Hey, what about that? And them? you see the money is continually to drop. Because I have no idea what I'm doing here. Hey, you blocking the wrong road, man! <laughs> the bank robber's in the other direction! Are you almost here? Nearly. Right. How you doing, son? You hear that gunfire? That's how I'm doing. So I guess we're shooting our way out of here. Where you at, kid? Listen to the shoot. Can't point they tough. We're holding here. You want to find the I'm gonna need the help out of here. It's getting hairy over here. It's hairy over here too, man. Chill. Oh, over here. Okay, so we made it. Here, only losing. Go, go, go. 
was it, about $20,000. Not great, but not too bad. And now we got to get in the factory before we get blown up by a tank. And there are two of them. I think maybe there's a third one. There's a third one. Hey, that's too bad. Shit happens. Move on. <laughs> so we got $7,983,000 basically right now. Now we... And we got a train to catch! They're all over us! We punch through! We get clear! Come on! Die, you pricks! How many dudes they got in this private army? But we shouldn't have to worry about losing any more. You should be cover, Frank. You don't want to get out front. Don't worry about me. Just keep holding. If I'd known you'd be this annoying. Yeah. How you doing? I'm cool. Just keep going. So I guess we shoot our way out of here. Come on, That ain't even fair. Paycheck's no good when you're dead, you ass! Who else would be fucking this up? Yeah, but I didn't see you. Ah, it was going so sweet! You holding on, Ep? I'll be cool when we out of this! Oh, more army showing up! Shut fuck off already! Hey, man, these guys are every fucking way! You got that right, Franklin. They everywhere. Hold them down! You wanna play with me? Ah. Grenade! Shit! Uh, no way! I think Trevor Fuck blew off up a uh, gas Last tank. Call. Could be our only way out of here! Kid! You still alive? I'm fine. fine. Let's keep moving! We punch through! We get clear! Come on! You Come on, you shit. assholes! Come on! The platform! We ain't got long! Hey, let's get this paper home! Hey, asshole! It's getting heavy! Now's when we could have used Daryl to help hold it together! I'd take this shit show over another few minutes of his shitty attitude any day! I knew he wasn't that good, but I didn't know he was a dick! Okay? I didn't come from me in the warehouse! Shield yourself, come on! Fuck me! Fuck off, asshole! How long we got a hold for? I just mapped the tank, you prick! Couple more minutes! Hey, where this train come? Just fuck off a minute. Where's the train? The train! It's our now only shot! train, we, we just come over here, we jump on, on it, and we're done. I'm a friendly, Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. Yeah, if you're expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay, and here's your cut. Considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. Oh yeah, that's a huge fucking win. Woo! Monsters. I'm out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the Worlds ago. Get your crew together, okay? Fucking punk. All right. We should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you home. Hey. Seatbelt. Well. Serious. All right. We got 
and sixty-two thousand five hundred and twenty-nine dollars. <throat> now, we dropped about thirty-two grand. Um, casualty expenses about a hundred fifty-eight thousand dollars. So. I mean, it's not too bad. But y'all, that is going to do it for for this episode. Um, once again, this has been James saying thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And <clears throat> come back and join me next time as we continue playing Grand Theft Auto V. Y'all, have a good one.